Take four. Seriously, fourth time making this video. First one I messed up because I tried to cut something out and ended up deleting the entire second half of the video because I'm an idiot. It was my first time trying to cut something out and somehow I screwed it up. Second video started with the camera flipped over the other way and I wasn't used to it, the button being on the left side. So I flipped over the video and then it recorded me upside down. Then the stand I use is the charger for the phone. It's a wireless charger. I had that plugged into the computer which then would cause the fan noise behind it to dub out anything I'm saying and it would just say throughout the entire damn video it's time number four and hopefully the last time I have to make this cock the video So I went to the store by my house, not by my house, by my office. I think by the fourth video, I know where I went. And bought a pop and two mystery minis. Mystery minis are Horace, Horace, Horror Series 3 minis. Which, from what I could tell online, sell really well. They're eight bucks at the store. I don't think anybody else is gonna buy them. I'll probably end up buying the rest, whether I buy two at a time or I'm hoping See, at like the end of June 29th, he's got this like half off sale for 15 minutes. So everything's 50% off for 15 minutes. And then the next 15 minutes, everything's 40% off. And then for a half hour, everything's 30% off. So if I could get these for $4 a box, it would be absolutely awesome. And I really don't think anybody else is buying them. But that being said, they're Walgreens exclusive ones. And they seem to sell well. Um, now, I pulled something that was one in, I think, 36 out of it. I do get the box right now, but I don't feel like interrupting the video. So, first off, the pop. They're not big pop place. They're, uh, they have them. But I think he buys them when they come in with, like, collections. He's a toy store and a comic book store. Um, he won't get new pops when they come out. He'll just have them when he has them. Um, but this one I bought because, uh, I think... From what I've heard, Masters of the Universe will not be made by Pop anymore, or by Funko. So I got the Specialty Series Trap Draw, which books at 16, and I paid about that, and that's fine by me. Um, if they stop making them, I think this has a chance to go up, and that's why I bought it. So it is a small investment. Um, I had a price tag on the bottom that I kind of took off and left some residue, but it was, it's on the bottom. The sticker's peeling a little bit, but I'm not going to play with it because I want it to stay on. And the pop, this curves up. But again, if you put in a protector, it looks like nothing's wrong. And it's really not that wrong. It's just got a little curve to it uh, for whatever reason. So, and other than that, I mean, it's really got, I mean, it's got some little scratches around. It's got some, probably some shelf wear. People have probably moved this around a bunch of times. Um, there's some stuff on here, like shelfware. Again, it's a cool looking pop. Then two mystery minis came. Um, the first one that we pulled, I put them in these little bags. They're called team bags. Or these are one touch magnetic bags. I'm not going to get into it. I got into it before. It was a 20 minute video. I'm not going down that road again. Uh, someday I'll explain the card industry and how I integrate it into the Funko community and will help anybody that wants help with it. I have no problem helping anybody with it. Uh, the first one was Wolfman. He's a $5 one. And then the next one book value means nothing on because it sells for over that. And this will go on Macari for more than it books for and probably sell. And it should sell relatively fast. From what I could see, I don't think anybody else has one up there right now either. So this one is one in thirty-six, I believe. One in thirty-six of the mini boxes, and is the Frozen Jack Torrance. This is a cool looking pop. Um, so. 
This book's a 22, I believe. And he sells on Macari for close to 40 shipped. So, I'm probably going to put them out there relatively high. Because there, I don't think there's any other ones out there. I'm going to ask a high price for it and see what happens. Um, I'm not going to sell it for 22. I probably won't sell it for under 30. <clears throat> including shipping. Um, and I always ship in a box, so that I, I don't know how some people ship. I think a lot of people ship those in bubble mailers, but I could be wrong. I ship everything like that in a box because I don't want it to get damaged. But he's going to go up for more than $22. So I hope you enjoyed. Um, the Wolfman's going to end up in like a mystery box or something like that. I have a bunch of these. Unless I just hold on to it, and when I buy more of those boxes, I'll stick them in a lot um, and tr try sell them that way. But otherwise, Jack will go up by himself. Hopefully sell within, like, a few hours. That'd be awesome. But I uh, hope you guys have a good holiday weekend. Remember who died for us to have the fun? Just give a little prayer for the troops. That's all. Happy Memorial Day. Enjoy. Welcome summer. Later.